Did you know that Live Tracker can actually create monitor mixes for your different musicians on stage? Yeah, it's crazy, but you can. Let's walk through it. So I'm going to bring up the, the audio mixer to full screen here using this, this stretchy bar here. And then we have our different audio monitors right here. So in our preferences, we can actually go to audio and set up our audio right here. Okay, so we're able to go ahead and set up our subgroup outputs to different channels on our audio console. And there's there's a whole bunch of channels here. Uh, the first the first set are stereo channels, and then the second set are mono channels. Okay. And so then we're able to turn them on or off using these mute buttons, and we're able to select each subgroup and and set a different output level on the left and right for each of the audio subgroups. There's 16 stereo subgroups. Then we set our hardware output to whatever hardware output we're using, say the last two, and we can play back our show. And we're gonna hear that audio in our audio monitor. So you can do this for yourself as well as your other musicians. Now, is this for everybody? No, this, this feature is not for everybody. For a lot of people, you are probably already using a digital audio console, um, you know, whether it be an X32 or an Allen & Heath or a Personas or whatever you're using. Um, and you'll probably just bring in your different tracks from Live Tracker and, um, and then um, do the audio mixes, your monitor mixes in that mixer. But it is an option. If, you're, if you've got a smaller setup, you don't have a mixer, but you have an audio interface, you can control it all from Live Tracker. And, you know, it's pretty cool that you can do it right here.